Okay, so let's start this up. Now, this mod does change with every iteration, so we'll see what they change, what the modders change in this one. Damn, please, why not? Let's see the classes. Are they still the same? Don't know. No, they are not, I think. Herald Captain Peasant. Brawler Hunter. Uh, the starting class doesn't matter that much because they made it so you can actually play with all the weapons without a problem. If it's still the same, if they didn't change the round. Summoner. <laughs> I'm not sure how you're even supposed to do anything with this guy though. Uh, let's go with the set Sentinel. Where's the point? What? Uh, I'm just gonna go for the master key. to the petrified giant okay what the hell is this Percent HP every second grants 30 stamina re recovery, reduce soul absorption. Uh, I guess that's the easy mode. I guess. Yeah, this 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 is what I like about the mod. You can no longer upgrade shields or weapons, so you basically can use every weapon because every weapon is buffed, more or less. Mystic. So this is a harder mode, I guess. I talk is it fire kill. I guess the explorer mode? No, 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 not this one. The wanderer mode is the one you want to play with. Oh, that's nice. Uh, Gin journey, yes. Let me check something real quick. I need to lower the graphics quality a little bit. I'm dropping some frames. 0.2% but not much but still. We already got fast rolls. Let's get rid of the shield. Oh shit. Yeah, see the beginning beginning area has changed again. We'll see what else has changed. No mimics. That's nice. Let's 
censoring paw. Me, every like uh, piece of equipment actually like gives you different stats in this too, which is pretty nice. You move 20% faster while wielding this weapon in held in the in the right hand, so as your weapon. Nothing on the left. We get the no, we didn't get the Ash and Essence Flask. Here? Nope. I think it's playing the same song over and over again. Yep, it is. About to change that. Hopefully the game doesn't crash. It can. Sometimes. Okay, let's see. Who's gonna whoop my ass over, over this way? Dismal night. No motherfucker, the range on that shit. Really? No, I don't like that. Usually I don't go for heavy weapons. Meaning I'm like faster weapons, not heavy weapons like this one. It looks like we can actually break his guard, yup. Oh, motherfucker. Jesus. Okay, that was lucky. What the hell does the tone do? I guess, I guess we can summon him. Summon him with that. Oh, nice. Also, uh, each one of these actually shows you what you're gonna get this time. And they added a lot more covenants, too. Which is pretty nice. Oh, wait, the forgot stream labs. Encoder overloaded. Which one? That is the question. Let's switch this to fast. That is a weapon of greatly increased flexibility. We bomb Kadafi's home. That is a weapon of greatly increased flexibility. Thanks for the follow slugs. He's up. Let's see what what's new here. I guess enemies are no bonfire. 
Do the answer. Wait, what's the attack on this? Uh, I do want to find a, a one-handed sword or something for sure. Too slow. I do uh, like who's gonna be the first boss fight, I wonder. Since I did change it around uh, quite a lot. Go kill this guy, then drop on the archer. I don't know how I broke through his guard that easily. Oh yeah, they added life gems too, which is, you know, kind of good since you don't get as many SS shard flasks as you usually do in the game, from what I've noticed in the mod. But every spell is... I think FP regenerates, right? Yep. So you can basically just use spells to get your health back. You don't even need SS flasks. You want to go that way? Who the fuck are you? Torch this early, really? Wait a minute. Uh, what? Wait a minute. How do we get to that guy? Um. I don't know. Let's find a bonfire first. Ugh, jeez. Now we didn't get the praise of sun emote yet. We are gonna get it. I think uh, Solaire is in this mod. A Vagabond. What? I guess we're too weak to fight him. Oh god. He's either gonna wreck me or just die without an issue. He's gonna fall off the map, I don't know. So much for the master. Estus ring. Nice and early. Hail to you, brother of war. <laughs> Free head. Hey. <laughs> Someone's got to get gonna get my head on a spike in this mall sooner or later. Probably the pursuer. Oh, that's that's the thing you do with it. I 
the one hit on the kill on everything is kind of nice though. This beginning bit is pretty fucking easy so far. Then again, it should be. It's the tutorial tutorial area, right? Ooh, a hundred arrows. You know what that means? We can kill the fucking dragon first time around. Okay, that's the Black Knight. I'm gonna find a bonfire, then mess with him. I mean, there should be one in the shrine, right? Alright. Big ass club. Yeah, that's the way to go. I usually go like when I'm not playing a modded version of the game. I just go with the deprived. Is it deprived? Yeah, I think it is. Just get the big ass club and kill your enemies with it. Works wonders too. Fuck off. You know, the stream laugh chat bot thing. Bugged out again. How oh, nice. It works. That's the funny thing, like, you know, Dark Souls, the easiest weapons, or the, like, most basic weapons are the best, usually. What the fuck is this? Take an appearance of a spooky skeleton. Ooh. That's what we want, right? There are beasts. Take an appearance of humanity spirit. <laughs> oh, we got drugs, boys. So this is basically if you want to look like someone. Uh, elixirs. What? Oh, this. These are just cosmetics, more or less. Oh, you don't need to mess with that at all. do want to get is this shield though it's fucking good and the armor is pretty nice too it's a dragon roar and drake fists aren't half bad either that lighting damage comes in ha handy warp covenant Athel Dragon. Let's see what his covenant gives us. Them drain delta the enemies uh, against the AI. That doesn't really help. Sure. Not bad. Alright. You can have pets in this mod. Literally. Who's damage of companion or companions? Not the. Pets. Yeah, Jesus Christ, that looks awful. Beckon local companions to the player. That costs a pretty fucking penny. On the Conant.
Just damage your companions. I know it's getting uh, you. One of the versions of this mod I used to you used to be able to get Solaire from the start, and he was, you know, basically a cheat mode to win the game. Can can never die, more or less. I guess should, uh, I should level up Fate so we can pick up some healing along the way. Uh, I guess we'll find out what the fuck. What the fuck are you? Increases max HP, max FP, and max stamina by two two point five percent. Oh, well, that's some fucking great armor, man. I should load a poise too. It fixes what? Oh, nice. Latin. You must kill the soul of Cinder's refrain from dying at the. Oh, fuck. Oh. I'm surprised there aren't any, like, Twitch streamers attempting that. Or I haven't seen any. Spellbound throwing knives. Uh, so that's basically infinite throwing knives. I have no idea what that is. I'm not gonna touch it Welcome to the bonfire. yet. Wait a minute. I don't want to buy a bow. Kill that fucking bastard out there, so let's take the katana. Okay, that's new. They changed the attack pattern. Yep. Well, he's worth nothing. Let's see what's new here. This is basically a training dummy. Andre can give us Well a newcomer I am not as of your top level I am Alright to change these around Consecutive attacks boost damage up to 15% not bad against bosses of course Well bosses that you can pull a combo off so dark is pretty good you can get some HP back from on hit fire applies deck and 1% fire absorption debuff for 5% 5, 5 seconds magic I think lethal and lucky are the best ones you can actually get 
Or you wanna just go on full on holy so you can like get that HP recovery. Shield infusions. Catalyst infusions. Cast speed. Now that's nice. Alright, we do want to get the bow from him. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to get the dexterity that high up. Always get the short bow. Watch me get it like on the first enemy or something. Fuck did I just kill? Okay, who knows? We'll find out soon enough. Hell does what the hell has that low HP? That's the question. That's not a mimic. The Dash Master. Jeez, look at that attack, man. Fortunately, you can't recover stamina while holding this. There's no need to jump up there since there's no fucking gate here. Okay, not the mimic. A frying pan. The best weapon ever. Hopefully patches doesn't uh, doesn't appear. And hopefully there's nothing up here. Well, no enemies that is. Drop, get the ladder down, then we'll go deal with the Black Knight. That's down there. Wait a minute. Was that usually there? I don't think so. Is there anything below there? Doesn't seem like it. Usually they do put a lizard there. The priestess ring. Wait, you did? Yeah, he did. Increases faith. By six. Okay, that's good. We can actually get the killing thing on us. There's a crystal lizard there. Mm, 
Who would have guessed that there's a crystal lizard, but it uh, usually is one, right? The fuck is this? Restores HP while standing, st FP while standing still. That's not that bad. Boost bleed resist. Damn, it looks shiny. Okay, the lizard is still there. Let's go get him. Hopefully that's not a mimic. Fuck six, hit the bastard. Lizard side. What? You used to acquire many souls. And the red eye ring. Well. What does this armor give us again? Damage against demons. We're not facing demons, are we? Let's go fight the Black Knight. Person, though, need to get used to that. <laughs> if we let get the Black Knight sword, that's gonna be fucking awesome. Not that I can actually use it yet. Got it. That was pretty fucking easy. The question is, question is, do I go up and drop down there? Now we can do that later on. I mean, we already know what we're gonna get from it. What's the point, right? Don't need it just yet. Alright, who did we kill when we dropped on him? Hopefully he respawns. It resp oh. It's a rat. It's Remy the rat. Okay, so this is the multiplayer. I don't know how it exactly works. Because you... You, two-player brawl... I don't know how this works because you want to turn the networking off for this mod so you don't get shadow banned. So I'm not sure how that exactly works. Boom, the covenant. Servant of the rat. Are we a servant of the rat? Increase all defenses and resistances by 5%. Why the hell not, man? Okay, we get 10k from selling the... Lizard hide. That's pretty fucking good, man. Okay. 
we can already get the lethal gem here. We'll travel to the high wall of Lothric. Nothing there, right? No. Nope. Right, maybe I should show off the bell. Because you can actually do damage with it now. Look at that. You can actually be an archer, you know. Until they get in close, I guess. Which is pretty decent. You know, you can actually use those as your main weapon. You know, just to pick off enemies from a distance. Okay, so I know it's one of the versions of the mod. The uh, enemy NPC spawned in here. Guess not this time. It's not open from this side, because of course, why would it? Wait a minute, that's the chest. Or is it a mimic? No, it's chest. stamina the more better I say okay, nothing there corner nothing okay so here's the NPC No heals for you, fuck off. And yeah, she's gonna give me the bow, never mind, she won't. If I really reduce weapon stammer, Ooh, look at this. I'm not the soccer ball, don't fucking kick me. The merchant ring. Increase endurance. Not half bad. Alright. The mercenary ring. Because that increases strength, right? No vigor. Okay. I think this transports us to drag heap if I'm remembering correctly. So I'm not gonna touch it yet. Use one of these. Let's 
see how much HP does it actually recover. Oh god. No, don't fucking pick it up while this guy is still alive. He does recover a decent amount. He finally got some throwing knives. Can you fucking miss all of them, man? like the move set on this well at least when it's two-handed and that ain't half bad I should be using the dragon one because I actually want the armor from it or the shield. Now I don't fucking get it. Why? Like for what do you need use Titan shard? Because. Uh, don't actually reinforce weapons in this mod or well at least in the one I picked the standard version you can still do it a dragon eye Okay, time to run like a bitch. Run, 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 run. Nope, denied. Okay, yeah, there's Solar, where, where he usually is in this mod. Uh, what do we get from his Covenant again? Lightning damage, of course, what else? I see you. would actually hit me on the other attack. Venerable Sagehood. 
course it's gonna increase. Oh, oh shut the fuck up, Kraken. I now I need to kill him. Outright. Okay, this one I need to mimic. Clerks Parma. Jesus Christ, the fucking thing is loud. Yeah, that was fucking close, man. Logic Knight Shield? Denied. Ooh, a black firebomb, though. Now I know there's some version of the, versions of them. Yep. He's there. He called the motherfucker from Irrital. Let's kill the dragon. He's fucking annoying. He did 10 damage. I heard of an enemy. Give 40 damage. Would be easier with the longbow, but. I think I aggro something from below. Sure. Yep, I did, probably. Alright, you can fast fire this spell. I forgot. Look at that. That was less damage there. have that many arrows there so we gotta take it a little bit slower god damn it calm your ass down I'm not gonna kill you actually although if I guess if you level up a bit and uh, get a better bow you could actually kill it outright Then we got the Drake Sword. Which does less damage. Because of course it does. was nowhere near his ass.
Throwing knives. I think there's shards. I think in the earlier version, wasn't there supposed to be more shit here? In an earlier version of the mod, I actually removed. Um, Titanus shards, outright, because you couldn't upgrade weapons at all. I guess they kept it in, in here, so if you choose the standard mode, you can actually do it. Yeah, I think that thing is up there, so let's see. Just heal up. What are we gonna die to it? Do we have anything with frost resistance? There's not cross resistance. What would that be? Like magic? Okay, maybe I was wrong. It's not that thing. It's this thing. Maybe even worse. Oh, definitely. Walk on to the fucking thing. Alright. That's wonderful. No, not this. Got to poise my way through it, I guess. That's how you do it, boys and girls. Oh, shit. Whew. Wait a minute. Since I got the infinite... FP, right? Wait, what, what was... The, yeah, this. You can basically use that forever. And what did we get? We got some chalice. Where the fuck is it now? Fallen enemies in power soul is absorption. Uh, I guess that's good if you find a shitload of enemies in one room. Let's see if we can kill two guys with this. Yes, we can. crossbow. Did we get any bolts? Yes, we did. Can we actually use it? <laughs> yeah, using two crossbows is actually viable now. And it's pretty fucking fun too. I don't want to go 
of that way yet. Well, there's supposed to be a big guy here. Yup, there he is. Ooh, and we got a bonfire too. was down here again oh god dogs I think I'm gonna need to rest at the bonfire maybe go go by the bear equipment that would be nice Yeah, sure, let's do it. Uh, following shrine. Right, this guy. That's just the OP shit, right? <laughs> More or less. Offerings. What do we need for shield? 10? Okay. How much for the fists? Wait a minute. 32 faith? Oh, Jesus Christ, we're never getting that. Let's see what Grey Rat has for us. Embers, bombast mace, spear. So basically the same old shit. Except there's a thief back, backed, which gives us item discovery plus twenty five percent. Actually, sell all this shit. I think we can get the full set still. Let's, let's grab what we can. Let's grab the most expensive shit first Armor of the Bear. That's my kind of armor. Piece of pink, 630. 